We moved up to the Bay Area from Southern California in, I think, 2012. Never forget um, the first time seeing Julie go get in the waters, full you know, five four, five or four wetsuit and like a you know a hood and booties and you know from this person who had been you know surfing out uh, near Sano, she just looked like a space alien getting in and out of the water and she was so cold and this whole idea of Traveler kind of came out of necessity so we were just trying to figure out a way if we don't live close to the water in the Bay Area in a city environment is there an easier way to get it out of the ocean to experience that surf community everything from trying to you know find a place to store longboards so we don't have to lug them up two flights of stairs without a garage to um, just having a place where you can take a hot shower and kind of thaw out when you, when you kind of step out of the ocean. A typical journey when you arrive at Traveler, you could have arrived via the Amtrak right down the street or you could have ridden your bike here, or motorcycle, or driven here, gotten dropped off, whatever. <laughs> you land at Traveler and um, you can either you know, rent a board and wetsuit and, and get out there or you can come into your locker, grab your board, get changed you know, in a nice clean changing room and then walk down to the beach or we have some beach cruiser bikes with racks on them um, at some of our shops. So making your way down to the water, it's only a block away from all of our locations. And once you, you know, paddle out, have a nice session, then you can come in and, and sit on the hot, heated bench. Hopefully Traveler helps um, save time in your day because it takes away some of those speed bumps. Now we've kind of grown into four other locations. We're in Malibu, Ventura, here, uh, Santa Cruz, and Pacifica. So the idea is you can have this wonderful experience as a member, as a guest, up and down the coast, checking into the traveler shop. I was introduced to surfing when I was probably about eight years old. I ended up surfing so much and, and getting into the competitive sphere, so I did the longboard tour in my 20s. Surfing has been a part of my DNA since I was young. We work very closely together and we really enjoy it. I think this last few years, especially during the pandemic, we've just been really side by side um, every step of the way. And as you know, cheesy as the metaphor is, it's like tons of waves, tons of wipeouts. Um, and that's kind of our whole experience together, I think, as co-founders, as business owners, as partners. Building a community has been really important to Traveler because I think surfing can be a little bit of an intimidating sport and lifestyle to especially to get into. We have a lot of events like pop-ups, movie nights, uh, panel discussions, surf meetups, and you know, it's, surfing is such a great community in itself. Um, we're just trying to expand that and, and really be an inclusive place uh, for people to feel welcome.